30 years of being married, I think the answer really is, you know, if you want to stay together, you got to stay separated. <laughs> I think that's the answer, right? Yeah. Yeah. That is the answer. Right. My wife's actually here. Yeah. She's in the car waiting. <laughs> it's enough distance. Just do, do, do your little show, bring the check out, we'll do mobile deposit, that's how she does it. Stay separated. Give yourself some distance from each other, right? Right? Square footage, I think is the answer. Nice size house. Get a big house, right? Take out a jumbo mortgage if you have to. Get a big house with separate vanities and separate toilet rooms. And those fart fans. Make sure you have a fart fan. Keep away from each other completely. Forget the tiny house movement. You know how many divorces that caused? The sustainability bullshit? Fuck the earth. <laughs> You're trying to stay married. I know there's a lot of romantic couples in here. I see it. I see it. I see them in the restaurants, you know. You see that romantic couple sitting on the same side of the table. Right? Like they're AGT judges. You ever see those two? Sitting on the one side, nobody on the other side, like they're on a, a double date with nobody. It's the weirdest thing, right? People are like, oh, how romantic. No, man, those people don't like each other. They don't want to make eye contact, don't you understand? They are sick of the view of each other. That's what's going on there. When me and my wife go to a restaurant, table for six. Every time I tell the hostess, table for six. They're coming, trust me. If I go to a hotel, I always get two double beds. And the guy's like, we got a king. I'm like, what are you, a marriage counselor? <laughs> two doubles, four pillows, pal, that's how we do it, 30 years. One for the roll in the hay, the other for the walk of the shame. That's how we do this. Wet dock, dry dock, that's how we do this. I know what I'm doing. That's how you stay married. Stay away from each other. Stay away. Yeah, there's a bunch of young guys here tonight, man. They don't know what the hell's going on. That's what you gotta tell these guys. Thank God you came. 2022, it's hard to be married, man. It's hard to be. 1922, probably easy as hell. Right? Because guys died at 48. That was easy. You got married, right? The priest like, till death do you part. The guy's like, I can do that shit. What are you kidding me? Huh? I'm almost dead now. There's a plague in Europe. I got an abscess tooth. They can't fix that. I got a built in out. Don't you understand that? Hallmark don't make 50 year anniversary cards in 1922. 